All righty, guys, I'm working on a 2011 uh, Ford F250, the 6.7 liter. Came with the P0401 issue. So what I found is that the EGR valve usually has this problem. And what I found, so I pulled the EGR valve first, make sure it wasn't plugged or anything. Once I had it plugged, I noticed that my secondary cooling system was also low on coolant, so I checked for a leak. You see my pressure gauge on there. Checking for a leak. So what I did next was check operation. So you're going to need a scan tool that has bi-directional controls in order to do this. So I got the orange white wire back probed. And then uh, I got my scan tool right here. Probably won't be able to show you actuation on the scan tool. but So with that valve fully closed which it is right now, that should be below one volt. I'm at 2.9. You can see that I'm at 0% duty cycle, which means zero. It should be closed. And it should be at one volt. So I already know that my valve's starting to stick. If I look in there, you can actually, I don't blind you guys. You can actually see that it's kind of cracked open right there. I if I pour the light through that side. Can't really get the light to show through, but you can see that how it's open. You can see it right there. You see the split between it. I have it fully closed, commanded, and it's still open. So now I'm gonna command it fully open. We're at 100% duty cycle, and it went down in voltage. So it's actually doing it opposite. It's trying to close it. Which is pretty insane. And that's how you diagnose this sucker. Hopefully this helps.